Hello everyone, it's Vibonic Zombie. Welcome back to Dark Romance Vampire in Love. So, we just found uh, these things. Boss relief detail, and so, and, and, and a note. And we have to get this note to Enron because that's how he'll be able to open up the gate. And I'm saying boss because I'm thinking of Boss Rutten and that's how his first name is spelled and that's how it's pronounced. I'm probably incorrect. Um, but... Let us continue. Okay, so I'm not sure where that goes. We need, have, we need one more clock part in order to solve that. We still don't have pieces of... Oh, but we do have the bat for this. Oh, it's a maze. Lower the pin in order to open this door. Use the buttons along the side of the maze to turn it. Okay. Okay. There we go. Okay. That was definitely one of the simpler ones. Guest room. Great, I managed to open this door and I can enter this room. Get it in. I can't go into this room. Okay. So... I think this is where Bridget was. Or no, probably not. But there's another coffin in here. Coffin! Most vampires sleep in coffins. First, they protect them reliably from the sun's rays. And second, as strange as it sounds, they just find them comfortable. Okay. Lost Relief has missed some pieces without the door won't open. Okay, it's not one of the pieces it's missing. I have firmly sealed the grave of my little girl and... There's a gargoyle piece. I have firmly sealed the grave of my little girl and it will not be easy for her to open it since I hid the parts from the lid of her grave in my castle. Wow. Okay. Looks like a hiding place. Just have to find the right key for it. And we have cylinders. Okay. Okay, girl portrait. Judging from the date of the portrait, the girl lived in this castle more than a hundred years ago. What was keeping her here so long and not letting her go? Judging from the date of the portrait, the girl lived in this castle. Oh, it's the same thing. Okay, so there have been. This is the second or third time um, this game has had typos. Not that, like I said, I'm not trying to be critical, but just little things I notice. I need to find the last piece from the clock in the hall and repair it. Then I can find out what happened here and how I can help the, the lo little ghost girl. Then the main thing is that I can understand what threatens me and how to avoid it. Note an office. I learned about the girl's grave. It has a clever lock and its details are in Dracula's castle. I have to find a new way of getting in touch with Enron and I hope that he will get these details. So Dracula knows she might be able to open it. These look like harpies. There are a lot of unusual locks in this house, and here is yet another one. But some parts are missing in order to open it. I have some wings. Okay, so... Arrange the wings so that they match the fairies. Oh, these are fairies, okay. Select the wing and then swap it with another. Okay, they glow when they're at the with the correct. Whoa. Okay. There's a map picture, and there's part of the key. Okay. This isn't the best time for a vacation. I better get out of here as possible. I just wanted to see. You're the one that's showing me the magnifying glass. Okay. So, here is... What's this one? 
In order to open this safe, turn the circles so that the sum of the adjacent numbers is equal to the numbers drawn under the circles on the safe. Okay. Okay. And run, dear. It looks like there are vampires in this castle. What am I to do? Find me and take me away from this terrible place. Dear, don't worry. I'll do everything I can. I need your help. Find me the second half of this note, which I can use to enter the castle. Oh, so they're talking to the magic ball. Okay, well, I have the note. It's right here. Here, take this. I hope you're looking for exactly this note. This is the one Perhaps that says you note. can find part of the gargoyle's head here and hand it to me. Thank you, dear. That's just what I was looking for. I will try to find the shard of the gargoyle's head, and will give it to you immediately. So it's like the Palantir of in Lord of the Rings. So this is its handle. Here's the handle. Except, uh, I don't believe you can pass objects through the Palantir, but you can communicate with others through it. It's kind of like a ancient um, cell phone. Okay. So, let's go back to the coffins. Room with the coffins. Oh, it's another hidden spot. But let's open this first, since I've been waiting. Okay. And that is a face. It's literally a face. Okay. There it is. We have gloves. Okay. Oh, it is telling us to change. Let's go to Enron. Okay, now ooh. Okay, we have a note. We can. Oh, this is Thomas. Okay. Go here and have a note to start on this. Okay. Align the symbols on each ring from left to right to match the sequence that is drawn on the note. The door will automatically open when the sequence is correct. Okay. 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 Now I go into the castle. It's been so many years since I've been there. We will do that, Enron, when we come back with the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye!